This is the Entertainment Execution Lab Podcast, Episode 10, and tonight, we have another supremely stupid story to cover. Yes, Disney is at it again. It's just another day in that stupid corporation and another dumb, stupid move that they've made. This one centers around their, you know, trash pit streaming service known as Hulu. A streaming service that is so bad that Disney actually has to trick people into getting it. Don't get me wrong, Hulu at one point in time was actually somewhat decent, not great, not even good, just kind of fair. But the second Disney bought it out, well, it went even further into the shitter. What's the story I'm going to be talking about in this episode? Well, this one comes from Bounding in the Car. And it is written by Spencer Bacoli. And here it goes. Hulu original film, Not Okay, has been given a trigger warning for, get this, unlikable female protagonist. That's right. They're giving out a trigger warning for that stupid shit. Unlikable female protagonist. I'm kind of surprised that no one's actually covered this story yet, but then again, is this story really worth covering? Maybe, maybe not. I mean, let's face it, Disney is dumb. Hulu's even dumber. I mean, you actually have a major studio that is trying to work their way out of existence. So am I surprised at this? Sadly, no, I'm not. I mean, seriously. How stupid do you have to be? How lame brain do you have to be to make a trigger warning specifically stating unlikable female protagonist? I mean, seriously, what is this movie's demographic where they are going to actually have to come up with a trigger warning like that? Alright, so this is basically going to be the movie in a nutshell. It's written and directed by Quinn Shepard. Not okay centers on... Danny Sanders, played by Zoe Deutsch, a young woman who, in an attempt to gain popularity and romantic attention, falsely claims that she will be soon embarking on an extended trip to Paris, keeping up the ruse by photoshopping herself in the various landmark photos, all the while sitting at home in New York. Yeah, you got that right. A trigger warning because a girl lies about going to Paris. She's an unlikable protagonist because she's lying about going to Paris. Apparently she gets into trouble. And this is a giant spoiler alert coming up. So if you don't want to be spoiled on what happens, you should probably not listen to the rest of this. But then again, I don't think that anyone who would be listening to the show right now would actually be going through the trouble of watching this film. Well, anyways, here we go. While just sharing a doctored photo of herself at a monument, the monument is apparently attacked by a group of terrorists. And this makes her look like she is a survivor of a terrorist attack. She apparently decides to go on with the ruse, and well, Everything else unfolds after that. I'm not going to get into any more of this stupid movie, stupid plot, because this wasn't a review. This is just some stupid news about Hulu deciding to put a trigger warning in front of one of their movies because the protagonist is unlikable. I'd say, come on, Hulu. Come on, Disney. Do a little bit better. But, like I said, they're wasting absolutely no time writing themselves out of existence because of stupid shit like this. And just remember this, when you hear this story, Disney, about two years ago, bought out 20th Century Fox. So now they have a whole lot of other shit that they can ruin, and they already are in the process of doing that. Disney fucking sucks. This has been another episode of the supremely stupid news of the day. This has been the Entertainment Execution Lair Podcast. Until next time, 
just stay away from Hulu. It's a waste of fucking money. Ha 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 